Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hi, I'm Donna Lynn. This is Short and Sweet. Welcome. Today we get one exercise and one nutritional tip and that's going to help you stay strong and healthy. We're going to work on an exercise today that works on all the muscles at once. Now, how are we going to do that? Well, because we're going to work on a high plank. But wait, don't go away. Don't go away. I'll show you how to do this. And then all you have to do is stay there. Okay? Now you want to take a timer with you so that you can see how you're doing. And you want to increase that time more and more. All right? So why do we do that high plank? Well, because it increases our core strength. And since all our movements start in our core, good place to keep strong, right? And it helps our, our posture. Why? Why is that important? Because we don't want to crunch all those internal organs, right? We want to stay up nice and tall and helps us with our stability. Now that is the key to being active as we mature. So let's get started. Now, it's a pretty easy way to get started on this, and if it gets to be too much, you can come down to your knees, okay? I'm going to show you how to get into it, and then you can choose. So first, we're going to put those hands right under our shoulders, okay? Right under our shoulders, like so. And we're going to take these little eyes of the elbow, and we're going to rotate them to the front. Now, why do we do that? Because we want those shoulder blades to be locked in place. So we're going to rotate those shoulder, those eyes to the front, and that locks those shoulder blades down our back, okay? We're going to take one leg out, and we're going to keep our legs about hip distance apart. We're going to take one leg out and put that toe under, and when I do that, I'm going to make sure that my hips are nice and even, and that my core is tight. So I'm going to pull that belly button up to my back, right up to my back, or we say keep the waistband up to the ceiling. All right, so we have a little bit of a tilt in there. All right, so here we go. Hands under the shoulders. Turn the elbow eyes out to the front. We're going to turn those shoulder blades down the back. We're going to pull that belly button up to the ceiling. Take a leg out, turn the toes under, and then lift. Up we go. Good. Now, when we're up here, there's a few things we want to be mindful of. We don't want to sag. We want to keep that waistband up to the ceiling. You want to squeeze your glutes, squeeze those thighs, and just push those hands down into the floor. Now you want to just keep your eyes straight down in between your hands so that your head isn't extended or flexed like that. So keep it in line with your spine and just breathe. Here it is. Now, if this gets to be too much, just come down to your knees and just stay there for a little bit and maybe come back up again. Okay? Hey, not so bad for exercising the whole body, right? <laughs> yeah. Now, you know how we can keep our waistline skinny? Can keep our girlish figure? Well, today our nutritional tip is about eating whole grains. Now, I know there's some controversy about that, but let me tell you just a few things and then you can look for yourself. All right? Now, whole grains are loaded with nutrients, protein, antioxidants, B vitamins, fiber, and we know how important that is, and trace minerals whole grains actually keep our waistbands from expanding so we can see our toes, right? <laughs> and they help a reduced uh, heart disease. They keep diabetes too down, right? We can stay away from that and obesity. There's a lot of good stuff with whole grains, but there are a few things you have to look out for. One, they have to be whole. So they have to have the brand, the germ, and the endosperm. They have to be whole. They can't be processed, okay? Okay. The other is that they, and this is really important, they have to be organic. They cannot be GMO. So you have to look for non-GMO.
GMO, organic whole grains. Okay, so get some of those on your plate today, all righty? Now, you know why I do this. I do this so that you can look good, feel good, and move well. And I'm going to invite you to come to Vigor and Trim, our new membership site for health and fitness for people over 50, where we give you a personalized workout experience, okay? In the meantime, you come and visit us next week at Short and Sweet, and I'll see you there. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.